up guys this is the Austin Nerd Show and we're doing another unboxing and it is Loot Crate. Um, so the theme for this month is futuristic. Um, so I've of course seen a bunch of like the items that are not items but themes that are supposed to be in here and I'm not too thrilled about them but um, you never know they could still be cool items so we'll just have to see but here's the inside. Of course as you can see like a Futurama looking background there. Um, so we'll start with the biggest thing, and it is um, the Planet Express ship from Futurama. And this is another um, QM, so quantum mechanics figure. And so we'll open this, and this is a Mini Masters vehicle. So I've not seen these yet. Of course, we've seen the like other superhero figures and stuff like that, but not any of the vehicles. So hopefully this will be something new they're doing and um, can get some cool things. And it does look like from the start that there is a magnet or at least a magnet involved, so that could be could be cool, depending on how well it holds. Um, we'll go ahead and put that part in. And then the bottom here just hold, yeah, holds on by a magnet. So, well, there's the part that <laughs> could be not so good. Here we go. Okay. So there we go. So there is the ship again, and then there's... Um, there on the bottom the planet express ship and stuff and then of course future and quantum mechanics and stuff there on the bottom so that's really cool like i said the magnet probably kind of falls easily but it's still really cool um a new like i said new item and the ship and everything so that is awesome um next up we have a mega man um kid robot uh like figure here um so it looks like we could get any of those any of those possibly possible um, I'm sure this may be a Loot Crate exclusive, so it could be a different one. Um, but we'll have to open it up and find out. I like the look on the box. But of course, it is Mega Man done by Capcom. So let's see who we got. Once again, I don't know much of anything about Mega Man. Of course, um, I've seen him Mega Man before, and I know there. I've seen like TV shows and stuff. But I never got into it, but it looks like we have an orange Mega Man, or I don't know if it's Mega Man or not, but it kind of looks funny with the way he's, um, or whatever this is, it's like, I don't know if you can really see, but his head's like bit down all weird, it just looks funny and stuff, but they have arms of course that can move in, so you can aim his little gun up and stuff. I'm not sure if he's on the box here, so it looks like it's whoever that person is. So it may not be a Loot Crate exclusive, so just random, which is always cool because um, you always get the, sometimes the exclusives, you have no clue who it is because they're not on the box, but that's still really cool. So next up we have our shirt from the box, and this is what it doesn't, oh, I guess it's from Rick and Marty, I was about to say, I have no clue what this is from, but it says there, um, down there at the bottom, Rick and Morty. Again, never seen Rick and Morty. Don't know a whole lot about it, but this shirt looks really cool. I like the green on this blue shirt and everything. So hopefully um, this shirt will fit because we have a lot of problems with Loot Crate shirts. But um, yeah, hopefully this one because I really like the look of it So with those colors and everything. So that would be a really cool shirt to wear. So that is awesome. Then we have a Star Trek The Next Generation um, ship. I assume it's the Enterprise, but it's a Loot Crate exclusive. But I don't know what it is beyond that. If it's a sticker or a building thing so this is what it opened up it's hard to read but it says um the uss enterprise so i don't know if this is a sticker yeah it must be what it is it's a sticker of some sort so it looks like it has a bunch of like stuff from the show like the creators and um, all sorts of other stuff on here. Like I said, I don't know exactly what this is. I'm sure we'll read the um, Carter booklet or whatever, and it'll tell more about it. But yeah, it just looks like um, a thing for the like actual TV show. So like I said, we'll have to look into that. Um, next up, we have a um, comic book, and it's a um, from Valiant Comics, and it's a number one, and it's 400, 4001 A.D., and it looks like maybe Bloodshot on there. I'm not too familiar with the things, but it kind of looks like him, which I know is one of their big comics. And this is a Loot Crate exclusive. So I may um, have to read this to um, see what it's all about because I've never really 
um, read any of Valiant's stuff. But it looks really cool, of course. Like I said, with if this is Bloodshot, that's their one of their like main characters for their comic series. Um, so I'll finally get to see what he's all about and stuff. And our final thing in the box for this month is our pin, and of course it is the the Spock hands doing um, the whatever sign <laughs> you call it. And so that's of course July twenty sixteen futuristic. So once again with their new pins with a really cool Spock logo um, for the month. And so now we'll look in, of course, the booklet here and see what we can figure out. And so it says that sticker, it is a sticker, and it's a Star Trek dedication plaque replica decal. And so, um, yeah, it just looks like a um, pin probably from something in real life, like a plaque that they put up to um, memorialize whatever the um, Star Trek um, show and everything and that's a replica of it so that's um, kind of cool I mean it's a sticker not much use for it but it's cool that they um, did something like you know piece of I'd say like television history and stuff like that and then, of course a deeper look inside the box to see all the um, detail that they put in the box so that's going to be it for the loot crate this month bro what was your favorite item out of this box I'd say probably the Futurama ship um this is really cool like i said i'm kind of afraid with this magnet thing that not sticking um very well but i do like that um the mega man's cool but i think my favorite item is probably the shirt like i said even though i don't know what it is but i really like the colors of this so that's gonna be my favorite item for this shirt now we will do our um monthly uh competition thing between the boxes and we'll see which one comes out the winner so we'll be right back and we're back and so we've made our decision for this month and we are gonna go with um geek fuel we thought it had quickly one but we thought it um overall had the best items um for the month um nerd block besides the items we had extra which weren't on the card so they i would say they don't count because they were just extras like thrown into the box um but by the stuff that was actually supposed to be in the box and on the card, there wasn't that great of stuff in it. Um, the Loot Crate had a lot of good exclusives, but yet their stuff um, neither of us are really into, and the items weren't that great. They're like cheap plastic stuff. Um, but Geek Fuel had the overall coolest, like at least my opinion, best shirt. And it had that shower curtain, which is different and stuff. So we just went with Geek Fuel for this month. So Geek Fuel is our winner for the month. Um, be sure to check out all our other videos and we'll see you next time. Okay.